This video is going to be confusing. <laughs> we are going to declutter some things in my closet and I'm going to tell you why because I've only recently decluttered my closet but we're going to get rid of more and I'm also going to share with you some things I'm adding to my closet so that's why it's confusing. It's a declutter plus a haul, a thrift store haul. What did I say my name? I'm Erica, Erica Lucas. And I make videos about minimalism, decluttering, and organizing everything that is left. I have been on a journey for um, almost two years of figuring out how to live with less. In this video, I am participating in the Mega Motivation Playlist created by Dawn at The Minimal Mom for July. We are all challenging each other to a 15-minute declutter to see who can declutter the most in those precious minutes. I don't think I'm gonna win because I have been decluttering this closet for two years and curating it. It's kind of reverse decluttering thinking, curating what I'm keeping instead of what I'm getting rid of. I am going to declutter from my closet today because my pants are too big. <laughs> so I'm gonna celebrate the success of walking for six weeks, eating better, starting intermittent fasting, all of these steps that I have been taking for the last six weeks are adding up. The scale is not necessarily going down. I guess if I had to say, I would say maybe I lost, maybe I lost two pounds, three pounds in those six weeks. The, the weight's just not going down. I am absolutely eating less, eating differently, eating more healthy, and I've changed when I'm eating with intermittent fasting. The results do not show on the scale, but the results are in my pants. These things are too big. <laughs> I went for a walk yesterday in them and they were annoying. Walk 17. We are at a park in Annapolis and the kids are playing on the playground or they are riding their bikes on this loop that I am walking on. And I am wearing a pair of Capri jeans that are too big. These are usually tight on me and I can do that. Out of the dryer today and they're too big. So I know something's working, even though the scale hasn't hardly budged, my pants are loose. So walk 17 on the books, in the books, whatever, walk 17. So I'm super happy to be getting rid of some clothes from this closet that are too big. And I'm going to, oh gosh, I'm going to say this. I was a 1X. I was a size 20 American. I don't know what that would be internationally, but that was my size when I started this, the end of May. Uh, I weighed 206 pounds at the start of this. I, I weighed myself this morning at 203. Uh, two days ago, it was 202, so it weight goes up and down. That's a whole thing. But anyway, I have dropped a size, definitely. The, the clothes that I was wearing every day do not fit. They are hanging off me. They are uncomfortable, and I'm not happy in them anymore. And my closet needs to make me happy. It has made me happy for two years by curating things that I know feel fantastic, the fabric I love, the fit I love, which my fit is different now, and I'm super happy about it, in case you can't tell. So we're getting rid of this. Okay, this, well, I know it's too big. I'm just trying to find a size. The tag must have come off over the years, whatever. It's too big. When I put it on, it slides off. It's a maxi skirt, so it's already long. So this is going to be decluttered. Other things that I know were too big already. I'm gonna have to try some things on this skirt. I'm really excited about. This is a 1X. This is way too big. I put it on yesterday and there's no way that I can wear it anymore. I'm gonna address a question that I will probably get. What, because it's a, it's a question that's plagued me many times when I've lost weight before. What if I gain the weight back and I don't have clothes that fit anymore? Well, there's a fantasy self that you hang on to clothes that are too small in the hopes that you get into them. And then there's a fantasy self that you hang on to clothes that are too big because you're afraid you're gonna fit into them again. Um, and both of them are fantasy versions of your present self. And I'm not in the business of hanging on to clothes that don't fit 
anymore in my life. They don't belong in my closet. They don't belong in my life. And I, I am happy to donate things that don't fit that are too big. I struggled donating <laughs> things that were too small because I was hoping to fit into them. But I don't regret doing that now. I don't regret having donated clothes that were too small before because if I keep losing weight like this, I'm gonna treat myself to different clothes. My style changes all the time. Things that I like change. Um, I'm in like a bohemian, easy bohemian phase right now of clothes and jewelry. So, uh, you know, that's fine, which is why I went on thread up and treated myself to some clothes that are in my current size that are more of a fit for the style of fabrics that I like. It was a sustainable clothing choice by buying something secondhand. I'll leave a link for my thread up below. They're not sponsoring this video and I'm going to share with you what I got. Let's keep going. These shorts, these. <laughs> So I went from a size 20 to a size 18, but here's the, here's the kicker. The 18s are too big and this is an 18. This is too big. I wore this at the end of our camping trip and they were uncomfortably too big. The fabric was getting out of place. It was riding up um, on, on the inside of my legs. The waist was so big that I could I rolled it and it was uncomfortable. So I'm getting rid of them which means that I'm more of a 16, 18 now. And that's what I ended up shopping for and thread up. Okay, let's keep going. Cause I have more. Ah, all right. These are the ones that I know that are too big. These are my Tommy, Lawn, Tommy John extra, extra large. Okay. That's a tag no one on this planet can read that. Why is that writing so small? Whatever. There it is. Yep. These are my extra, extra large pajamas that I am donating. These are my extra, extra large Tommy John pajamas, also donating. Okay. These jeans. Wait, these are my capris. Okay, so these are the ones that I'm wearing now. Okay. <laughs> I didn't tell my husband that I dropped a size and <laughs> I said, I'm gonna be making a video of clothing that I'm getting rid of. Do you have anything that you wanna get rid of on camera with me? His answer was no. I'm gonna be getting rid of clothing that is, and I went like this and he goes, sexy? <laughs> well, thank you, but no, too big. <laughs> anyway, um, the, the, the capris that I'm wearing are too big. Look, look at all this extra fabric that's now bunching when I walk around. It, it rides up, it's uncomfortable. The waistband always has to be tugged up. So um, I have two of them. I have this one that is too big. And the ones I'm wearing are too big. I'm going to wash them before I put them in the donate pile. So these are gonna go awesome. Let's just put them in the pile right now and then I'll wash them beforehand. So let me put on, let's put on these, okay? These are 16s. Let's see if they fit. They did not fit six weeks ago. Okay, they're a little snug but I actually think they, they fit. Oh, they feel fine. <laughs> so I'm a 16 in these shorts, got rid of the 18. All right, more. These, I'm gonna try these on. So, and these still fit, they still, they still fit fine. I'm gonna keep these. These are an 18, my shorts were 16. So like I said, I think I'm in 16, 18. I'm gonna keep these. I'm donating these black ones. Um, I, they're too short for my liking. So I wore them camping, I didn't like it. All right, what's in here? Okay, so in here I have yoga pants, my thermals, my summer hat. Um, we got this right after we got married 11 years ago, 10 years ago. I don't know how long I've been married in St. Augustine, Florida, on a trip to see Aunt Ginny. Let's see, these are our one recently fits, 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 fits. Okay, this is a 1X. It is big. Um, I also don't like how the strings are. I, they kind of itch my skin a little bit and I don't like that. Um, it's a beautiful blouse, I've worn it many, many times, but I am ready to let go of it because it is too big. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of this one. 
I can't, I just unpacked this when I unpacked the kids' summer stuff. I've worn it once. I don't like how the collar is, even though it is an extra large, which is my current si top size now. Um, I don't like how the, it itchies. It's itchy. I'm going to get rid of this. It's, it's a 2XL and it's too big. Therefore, it's not my fit and it's not complimentary. Ooh, that's stack it up. Okay, the rest of this fits. Okay. Ooh, dresses. <laughs> this I got last year from Thread Up. It is too big. It's um, a 1X. It's, I love the color, I love the fabric. It's so cute, but it doesn't look right on me anymore. Now that I've dropped a size, it just it kind of looks like a blanket. Oh yeah, 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 here's another one. Okay, I have never been this excited to declutter clothes. <laughs> okay, this is a 1X from Lane Bryant. They call it the 1820. I love this color. This dress is so cute when I put a belt on it and pair it with like a little black jacket, but it's too big and um, I'm ready to let go of it. Here's my pile. <laughs> Let's do a count. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12. 13 things. That's my number, Dawn. I got rid of 13 things. This one I just set to the side because I need to wash it because I was wearing it before I donate it. Okay. This is my haul from Thread Up. I'm going to try each of these on right now just because I haven't even tried them on, but I bought the next size down because I was so excited. So this is an extra large white summer dress. This is an extra large brown skirt. Kind of nervous about this one. This is an extra large green shirt. This is an extra large blouse in the vintage dot that I love. And then this is an extra large skirt. Kind of nervous about this guy too. Not sure how it's gonna fit, but we're gonna find out. I'm gonna start with the skirt. It's not pinching, it's... <laughs> it's even big! It's even big! <laughs> Richard's big! He's too big! Oh. It's, it's too big, it's, it, it's just falling when I even moved a little bit. It's too big! I'm so excited. Okay, go later. Okay. Oh man, it's so cute. I wonder if I could get away with it, like, with something tucked in to kind of add something. Or if maybe this belt would make a difference. So cute. <laughs> this is pretty cute, though. But it feels too it feels too big like it feels I can feel it moving around riding up right there and now it's fall it's falling down it's sliding down it's too big I'm gonna try the the other skirt uh, that I was nervous about that I'm less nervous about now this is not too big and not too small and this is also an extra large. The, just the fabric and the brand is different, so it feels different. This is pretty cute. Okay. All right. This is a keep. I don't usually tuck my shirts in, so I would probably wear it with something kind of 
hanging down. Okay. Okay, so this is a shirt. This is an extra large. I usually wear, well, I guess I used to wear an extra, extra large. So this is feeling a little snug in the bodice. Not too snug here. Not too snug when I move my arms. I think this looks okay. Oh, this is soft. Okay. Ooh. Oh, this is soft. I love this. This doesn't fit quite have the snugness. Snugness? Is that a word? This is not quite as snug as the polka dot one. And I'm keeping this one. This, one, this one's fine. <laughs> I have for years wanted to rock a summer dress like this and not be uncomfortable in it. This fits. It's an extra large. It, I have dropped a size. This is so cute. So I need two things. I need a slip. Yeah, I'll need to get a little waist half slip. And I need a different bra. This, I'll need like a strapless bra. As I continue to lose weight, I will have to get my bra resized. I wanted to go back and get sports bras anyway for all the walking that I'm doing. And now I need to get like a summer bra that I can wear with a dress like this. This dress fits, I am so happy right now. Okay. So like I said, this was a, a thrift haul from Thread Up. Thread Up is an online consignment thrift store. I'll leave a link below if you guys wanna check it out. They're not sponsoring this video, um, but I it's a sustainable clothing option. Everything I just showed you, all five pieces, was $31. I kind of want to just hang out in this dress all day, but I don't want the bra or the slip. <laughs> I'm so in love with this dress. I need to get, I need to, I need to get the things to be able to wear this dress. Okay. Thank you for watching. Check out the playlist below for the mega motivation 15 minute declutter. Thank you to Dawn as always for organizing it this month. Thanks for watching. Here's the latest video.